Hi Leo, I'm Anisha and you can visit me on www.tarabyanisha.com and this is your monthly forecast for February 2012. The big news for you is the Neptune move. It has been there in your 7th house for the last 13 years, which basically ruled relationships and love and marriage and now it moves to your 8th house that is about um, uh, regeneration, rebirth, uh, it's about um, contractual deals, it's about um, lawyers, accountants. The Neptunian energy till now when it was there in your seventh house, uh, you know, made you look at all your relationships in a very idealistic way and uh, um, now with Neptune moving on to your eighth house, you are going to be looking at things without the rose-colored glasses. You're going to be seeing things for the way that they are. And uh, it's, it's going to be something of oh. awakening for you, you know. Uh, so wherein that you have in the past kept uh, close partners on a pedestal. This year onwards, it's, it's going to change and how. And uh, you're going to be looking at people for who they really are, what they really mean, what uh, uh, value they get to your life. and. Um, you know, the, the, there's just going to be a far deeper bond uh, this year, Leo. It, it is no longer just going to be a wild, passionate and lust. You're going to be wanting more. And uh, there's going to be uh, a lot of spiritual um, connect with the Neptunian energy coming in into the 8th house. Uh, you will want to have the deeper connect uh, with uh, your closest partnerships or with your potential partnerships. and. Uh, you would really want it for keeps, you know, it is no longer going to be a, okay, nice to know you and tomorrow, who are you, kind of thing. So, um, and, and for Lewis, I think it's uh, something which is, um, it is phenomenal for you because, uh, you know, all along you have, uh, besides, of course, your gregarious and the party and uh, not wanting to attach yourself to a particular person. Uh, there has been a part of you which has wanted something more deeper, which has been more lasting. So this energy is there uh, till about 2025 in your 8th sector and it is going to be of immense help to you, provided you work with energy. It's also that you're going to be looking at, uh, looking over your shoulder really. So you're going to be looking at some past relationships, maybe you're going to be looking at some ex-lovers uh, and uh, or uh, places where you worked with uh, some kind of a nostalgia over there. So you would be thinking as to, uh, you know, uh, or what is it that, how, or how it is, it would have been if that person was, were there in your life or, you know, the last organization or collaboration or business partnership that was there. So there's going to be some amount of a uh, nostalgia looking over the uh, shoulder really bit. Um, there is some amount of a, a, a travel for you and uh, this month, not really a long distance travel, but uh, yes, travel uh, nonetheless. Uh, you will also be this month looking at uh, contractual obligations, uh, collaborations, so you will reach out and look at all the deals that I've got done, maybe uh, you will be looking at the finer print as of now and seeing whether uh, things are what they really seem on the paper. So, uh, overall a good month for you, Leo. Yeah, I'd say it's, it's a brilliant month. So, have a great February. I'll see you again in March. And thank you for watching. You can visit me on www.tarabayanisha.com.